having a bit of an issue. Okay. Uh, I was wondering, uh, I got a couple of uh, cans of, um, uh, I, think, I believe it's called Fish Feast. Uh-huh. And, well, I need, uh, could you speak up a little bit? I can barely hear you. Yeah, I haven't said anything. I'm just listening to you. Uh, well, uh, I I was wondering if I if I I I have about ten twenty cans of the fancy feast, and my cat recently got ran over by a, a greyhound, and I'm wondering if I could use the cat food on toast or like you know make a hamburger or something. Uh, yes, yeah. I guess you can do whatever you want with the food. I was told that you chop up horses to make the food, and I don't know about that. What is it made out of, like the ingredients? I, I just don't want to eat horses. It's made with chicken and all of that. Oh, okay. Uh, the, I know I haven't. Oh, could I make it into a stew? Okay, I have one more question though. What's that? It would be, uh, I really don't know what it was, like inside of the can, I opened it, I was going to make a burger, and I found a toenail. Oh. Yeah, is there something that I could get a refund for, because I don't think cat food is supposed to have toenails in it. Does it with them? With who? With the company. What's the, Petco? Now, it says Petco finds a feast on it. It doesn't say Petco on it. It does. I'm not lying to you. It's in my hand right now. You call me a... It might be in your hand for four years. And well, I've been buying this food for ten years. It does. Well, i got to go. Hello? Beat you. Is this all? Is this necessary? I have a shark tooth in my burrito and a toenail in my drink. I just want to bring it in and get a new burrito. You just want a new burrito after all that happens? Uh, I mean, it's kind of expected by Taco Bell.